Hi guys, today I'm here to review this ring that I got from Julia. Um, as you can see, it does come in the small little case. So if you are going to send it to somebody, it's not going to look cheap. I have worn it, but I have also kept the case so I can do the review. As you can see, there is the case. And there is the actual ring. Let's zoom in on it. Now, uh, let's go over some of the parts of the ring. Um, it is not cubic zirconia, first of all. It is a um, white sapphire look it's a sa it's a lab created sapphire is what i'm saying so let's go over it the as you can see in the stones here uh there are approximately 104 um stones well not approximately there are 104 stones of course you have your bigger stones in the centerpiece here and then along the lines over here you have a small band of stones and another small band of stones and then let's see if i can get a zoom in on that without really seeing it so you have your large stones right there larger stones right there small stones right here small stones right there and my camera keeps saying oh i want to zoom in but you know um as you can see there it is gorgeous it has that real sparkle on it especially when the light hits it now let's take this out as you can see here the band is a sterling silver it does scratch um, I've been wearing it for a couple weeks and as you can see there are little nicks and scratches on it. Um, when it comes to actually holding the stones uh, on the inside you can see there that they are held very nicely. Uh, there is no way for them really to pop out. I haven't had any issues with them popping out or anything like that. Um, it weighs approximately 7.5 grams so it is a little bit on the heavier side as you can see it right there against my hand. Um, its width is about 5.6 mm. Uh, um, it does uh, have a lot of gorgeous features about it. Of course, it is also nickel free. Um, for me, I've been married a few years, so this is more of a uh, band that I would wear, you know, just as a uh, everyday kind of thing and not really as an engagement band I guess you could say but you could use it as an engagement band if you wanted to um, like I said the, the ring is absolutely gorgeous as you can see on my finger right there it does take up a nice little amount on your hand it really is a game changer people notice it they say oh my god where did you get that it looks very pricey but it's not all of the stones are lab created um, when you're looking at the hardness versus a diamond. These are a nine. Cubic zirconias are an eight. Diamonds are a ten. So of course diamonds being the hard, most hardiest uh, you know, uh, stone, you want the closest as you can to a diamond. These are literally right under a diamond for, in terms of hardiness. Now um, I work with my hands like a lot around the house as y'all know. I do a lot of reconstruction around my house. Um, re reconstruction. Remodeling around my house. Woo! <laughs> But it has lasted. I've worn this. It lasts great. You can get it in half sizes, full sizes, whatever. It's so affordable, yet it looks like you're paying a million bucks for it. Um, I did get this at a full promotional discount for my unbiased review in return.